Diogo Delo makes suffering admission after disappointing Manchester United season. Diogo Delo delivered consistent performances for Man United last season and will play a key role for Portugal at Euro 2024. Manchester United defender Diogo Delo believes winning the Players' Player of the Year award is recognition from the teammates he suffered and celebrated with last season. Delo lost his starting place at right back at the end of the 2022-23 season, but he enjoyed a renaissance last term and earned praise for his consistent performances. The fullback started 35 games from a possible 38 in the Premier League and managed to avoid injury throughout the campaign, only being unavailable once through suspension. Although Eric Ten Hag was forced to contend with an unrelenting injury crisis, Dalo was a mainstay in the team and his versatility in defense was an asset. At the end of the season, Dalo won the Players' Player of the Year award, which was voted on by his United teammates. The 25-year-old is a popular member of the dressing room and is known to do extra work outside of regular first-team training sessions at Carrington. Dalo is hoping to carry his strong form onto the international stage for Portugal at Euro 2024 and spoke at a press conference ahead of his nation's opening group game. The Portuguese media asked Dalo about winning PPOT and he said, Individual trophies always end up being positive. In my case, it gives me more confidence, more motivation. This recognition from my colleagues, from those who see me all, was great. Every day, for who I suffer and with whom I celebrate. It's a special recognition. Delo was quoted by Portuguese outlet O Jogo, and he was asked whether his performances last season have given him an advantage to be a starter at the tournament. It's a bit relative. What you do during the season can play a fundamental role in being here in the national team, but it's not enough to guarantee that you'll play, said Delo. It gives you confidence, but you have to show that you deserve to play. Fortunately, we have a lot of competition and quality. It gives me pleasure to have this healthy competition. It always keeps you out of your comfort zone and gives you motivation to continue working. I believe that my colleagues feel the same way. Portugal won the Euros in 2016, but Dalo was too young to be involved. It would be spectacular, he said, about the prospect of winning the trophy in Germany this summer. Feeling that moment in Azerbaijan in 2016 for the under-17 team was special. Winning for our country is always special. But for the A team, it would be a dream. I hope it's possible. Dalot has 20 caps for Portugal and feels he's in the best shape of his career, so more will come in the future. I think so, in individual terms. My career has been progressive. I don't hide that it's a good moment, perhaps the best in my career. But it's worth it, he added. If I don't continue to demonstrate that I deserve to play, the work continues day by day in the same way to be able to continue with the level of fitness that I've been demonstrating. Portugal begin their Euro 2024 campaign against the Czech Republic on Tuesday night. Chat GPT Diogo Delot, reflecting on his recent season at Manchester United, openly acknowledged the challenges and frustrations he faced during what he described as a disappointing campaign. The Portuguese fullback, known for his versatility and attacking prowess, revealed that the season had been a period of suffering for him personally, citing limited playing time and inconsistent opportunities to showcase his abilities. Dalot's admission highlights the difficulties he encountered in establishing himself as a regular starter under various managerial regimes at Manchester United. Despite demonstrating glimpses of his potential and contributing positively in sporadic appearances, he struggled to secure a consistent role within the team's lineup. The 23-year-old's remarks also underscore his determination to overcome setbacks and regain momentum in his career. Dalo expressed gratitude for the support he received from fans and teammates throughout the season emphasizing his commitment to continue working hard and improving his game. Looking forward, Delote's candid assessment provides insight into the competitive environment at Manchester United and the pressures faced by young players striving to make their mark at a prestigious club. 
His resilience and positive outlook suggest that he remains focused on seizing future opportunities and making a lasting impact, whether at United or elsewhere in his football journey. The news that Manchester United is considering signing Dominic Calvert-Lewin adds another layer of intrigue to their summer transfer plans. The English striker's name has been on the radar of the Red Devils for several transfer windows, indicating a long-standing interest in his services. Calvert-Lewin's emergence as one of the Premier League's most prolific strikers has undoubtedly caught the attention of top clubs, with his impressive goal-scoring record and physical presence making him an attractive prospect for Manchester United. The Red Devils, known for their pursuit of proven English talent, see Calvert-Lewin as a potential solution to bolster their attacking options and provide competition for places up front. The striker's ability to lead the line, hold up play, and find the back of the net with regularity aligns with United's attacking philosophy and could offer a new dimension to their front line. His aerial prowess and knack for scoring goals from crosses could also complement the creative talents of United's midfielders and wingers, offering a different threat in the final third. As Manchester United weighs their options in the transfer market, the potential signing of Calvert-Lewin represents a strategic move to address areas of need within the squad. While negotiations and discussions are likely ongoing, the prospect of Calvert-Lewin donning the famous red jersey at Old Trafford will undoubtedly excite fans and add another layer of anticipation to the summer transfer window. With the transfer window in full swing, Manchester United's pursuit of Calvert-Lewin signals their intent to strengthen the squad and compete for honors on multiple fronts in the upcoming season. As the saga unfolds, fans will eagerly await further developments and hope to see the English striker spearheading United's attack in the near future. Indeed, Manchester United's consideration of signing Dominic Calvert-Lewin reflects a strategic approach to addressing specific areas of need within their squad. The Red Devils have long been seeking to bolster their attacking options, particularly with a reliable striker who can provide goals consistently. Calvert-Lewin's profile aligns closely with what Manchester United has been seeking. As a strong and athletic forward with a keen eye for goal, he offers a different dimension to their attacking play. His ability to hold up the ball, bring teammates into play, and finish chances effectively makes him an enticing prospect for a club like United, where the expectations for success are always high. By targeting Calvert-Lewin, Manchester United aims to add depth and competition to their forward line, providing alternative options and tactical flexibility for their manager. His physical presence also offers a different threat in the opposition box, which could prove invaluable in breaking down stubborn defenses and converting chances into goals. Moreover, signing Calvert-Lewin would not only address immediate needs, but also contribute to the club's long-term planning. At 25 years old, he is entering his prime years as a footballer, meaning he could potentially offer several seasons of top-level performance and contribute significantly to United's ambitions on both domestic and European fronts. In sum, the potential signing of Dominic Calvert-Lewin by Manchester United is not just a transfer move, but a strategic decision aimed at strengthening the squad, addressing specific areas of need, and positioning the club for success in the seasons to come. Absolutely. The potential signing of Dominic Calvert-Lewin by Manchester United represents more than just a transfer move. It signifies a strategic decision aimed at fortifying the squad, addressing critical areas of need, and positioning the club for success in the seasons ahead. As the club evaluates its roster and ambitions, it recognizes the importance of bolstering its attacking options. Calvert-Lewin's prowess as a striker makes him an ideal candidate to lead the line for Manchester United. With his combination of strength, aerial ability, and predatory instincts in front of goal, he offers a different dimension to the team's attacking play. Moreover, Calvert-Lewin's age and potential for further development align with Manchester United's long-term vision. 
At just insert age, he has already showcased his ability to perform consistently at the highest level, but there's still ample room for growth and improvement. By investing in him now, the club not only secures an immediate impact player, but also lays the foundation for sustained success in the future. Furthermore, Calvert-Lewin's style of play complements the existing talents within the Manchester United squad. His ability to hold up the ball and bring teammates into play can unlock the full potential of creative midfielders like Bruno Fernandes and Paul Pogba. Additionally, his presence in the box provides a target for crosses from wide players such as Marcus Rashford.